Nausea, dizziness, headaches, and cold sweats. What do these unpleasant symptoms have in common? Well, they're all signs of motion sickness. Mm -hmm. And an estimated one in three people experience motion sickness at some point in their lives. So, Dr. Ish, what? do you get motion sickness? 100%. If I'm in the car, and especially if I'm in the car and I'm on my phone or trying to read something, I get nauseous, I get dizzy, and I got to down and, a window and quick. And I think most of us, if mm -hmm. we try to do that, multitask yeah. in the car with that uh -huh. phone or reading something, that, that is a huge trigger. So yep. physiologically, how does it happen? When we're in motion, our eyes, inner ear, joints and muscles send signals to our brain but sometimes the wires get crossed and the clashing signals result in that terrible feeling of motion sickness and it's not good. It is, it is terrible and it lasts once the car ride is over, right? But there are some tricks to tackle most types of transportation. In a car, call shotgun. Shotgun! All right? Always you choose. You first, I guess I, I'll sit in the back. Always choose the front seat if it's possible. Now, if you're on a cruise ship, choose a lower level room. It'll help save your trip and it'll are help you save your wallet. Are you a cruise guy? Have you done? I've done it, but it's been a while. Well, mm -hmm. are you planning a flight? Well, for planes, seats near the wings are best and feel the least when it comes to in-flight movement. Now, uh -huh. taking a train, you should aim for forward sitting yep. seats near the front and near a window. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. you know, what that doing is just helping to balance that, that eye mm -hmm. input. You're, you're watching something uh -huh. instead of just sitting there and, and not seeing where you're going. Mm -hmm. Going by bus, well, make sure you grab a window seat and avoid the back of the bus. If you do start to feeling like you want to heave or you're going to hurl, Focus your eyes on something in the distance. Look to the trees, folks, or a stationary object, anything out there that can kind of plant you in the moment. If you have problems with motion sickness or medications, right. patches that you can use, talk to your doctor. Yep, yep. and they work great. They still work great. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, for more tips on how to move beyond motion sickness, visit us at our website, thedoctorstv.com. We're living in uncertain times. Delta variant is pushing. It's not always easy to keep up with the latest medical headlines. That's where the doctors come in. Now in our 14th season, the doctors continue to bring health and happiness into your life, giving you solid takeaway information. Things aren't being as heavily regulated as you might think. And we're uncovering medical scams to keep you safe. A lot of them contained a dangerous chemical known to cause cancer. What works and what doesn't. I'm always a doctor, but this was one of the few times that I was a patient, and it can be scary. The hottest trends in beauty and wellness. Pull it up, keep it tight. The prognosis is good. The Doctors, a prescription for a better you.